Now we'll see an example that makes use of conditionals in order to get the Chinese zodiac. So the Chinese zodiac is something according to years. So each year is a specific zodiac in the Chinese calendar. So first we are going to ask for the year from the user and then we are going to do a division of that year by 12 and according to the remainder of that division because that's the percentage sign what it's used for we enter a conditional with an if and several l if and finally an else to know which year it is if it's a reminder with zero a perfect division by 12 it's the monkey year if i get the rest of one it's rooster dog pig etc and in the end sheep if it's a reminder of 11. I do not need to say elif equal 11 because that's the last case that I have. So it's by default the final one. If it's not any of these, then it's this one. Let us run this program quickly and let us see together for different years what we obtain. So for example, if we enter the year 1987, we get that it's the rabbit year. So it means that the division of 1987 by 12 gives me a reminder of 7. So 1988 shall be the dragon. And 1989 shall be the snake. 1990 shall be the horse. And 1991 should be the year of the sheep. And so 1992 is a year that is perfectly dividable by 12. And so it's the year of the monkey. So that way we can enter any year we want and we will know which year in the Chinese zodiac it is. This is pretty simple. This is one if condition, but with several alternatives. 12, 12 actually possibilities. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you for example number four, lottery, which will interest a lot of you.